Hi, welcome to another tutorial on OpenOffice Calc. So last time we left off with this table, but now we would also like to add a date format. Now first let's give it a header, date, but we would like this header to be in the same format as the other headers. So what do we do? We can simply click on the other header. And then we can click on the format paintbrush right here and click on the date. And you see that it jumps to the same format as the other cells. Now this can be done also with uh, normal cells. For example, I'll click on this, I'll take the format and change it here. But we would like the format to be date, not numbers. So what do we need to do? Looking here, we got nothing that resembles date. So what we'll need to do to add the date button is simply click here, get the drop down, select visible buttons. And here we can see all the buttons that we can add that we do not see there. So for example, align top, bottom, and date. Exactly the one that we want. So let's click on that. And the toolbar updates, and we have date added here. So we'd like to turn all those cells into date format. So we just drag all the cells that we want and click date. Now let's add a date. Now this is a date format. If we right click and select format cells, then we can select the format that we want. Do we want it like this, month, day, year, or any other format. You can have it be your own custom format by just changing it right here below. Under format code, change it to, let's say days, months, and then years. And then you see, it changes to the right form, the 9th of January. All we need to do now is simply drag, as we did before, down to all the different cells. And as we learned before, you see that the 9th ter turns into the 10th and so on. And everything is correctly formatted. Now, this can be done with other buttons, so let's click on the drop down right here, visible buttons, and let's select another one, just so we'll have it in the toolbar. So we'd like to align center vertically or top. So let's click on that. Now we have align top added to the toolbar, and this can be done with all the different buttons that you see right here. And that's about it for now. I hope to see you on the next tutorial. Thank you very much. Bye.